All right, if you've ever seen The Lion King, you probably remember Zazu. He was supposed to be Simba's guardian. Zazu was a hornbill, and today you can meet the real life Zazu. Thank Dr. Jeremy Goodman, the executive director of the Roger Williams Thank Park you. Zoo, and Jen Rudolph, the manager of Ambassador Animal Programming, are here to tell us more about the hornbill. Is that what this particular bird is? You said it was... Yeah, so Zazu is a von der Decken's hornbill. A von der... Say it again. Deccans. Von der Deccans. Yes, and they're from Africa. They're from the, the scrubland of Africa. And uh, this is the type of bird that was in the Lion King. And uh, um, amazing birds. Uh, the hornbills come in all shapes and sizes. Uh, they're from Africa and Asia. This guy's from Africa. But, um, you know, he can get about two feet in length. But some of the larger hornbills can actually, uh, um, you know, be well over uh, four feet almost. He's so cute. And he's, like, very personable. But during the break, he was trying to feed Jen. Like, he thinks... <laughs> <laughs> that they're, that's like, he, he's a bird that really bonds with you. They have a really interesting natural behavior. So the females, uh, when they're getting ready to lay, lay their eggs, will go inside uh, a hollowed out tree and uh, the males will actually seal them up inside the tree. Oh. I know, it's crazy. Um, and they will feed them through a small hole. And that's how the, the, once the chicks hatch, dad will be responsible for feeding them both. Oh. Wow. Um, so she gets breakfast in bed every day. Every day. <laughs> every day. Totally yeah. reliant. Very Remarkable. devoted animals. Yeah. Really? Yeah. And you oh. say that this bird is free flight, so if it wanted to take off right now, it could take off? He could, yeah. He could, yes. So the, not, the wings are not clipped or anything? <laughs> nope, nope. He's, he's very well trained, and uh, he's, <laughs> he's one of our ambassador animals, so uh, we pick all of our ambassador animals for their personalities and uh, their behavior to make sure that they're all mm -hmm. well behaved. But uh, yeah, he actually um, not only goes to studios, but uh, we're just starting to take him out to schools and as part of our uh, education program so uh, does he yeah. come when called like you sometimes know, yeah like yeah. He, does he recognize his name Zazu he does yeah okay he's yeah. like I am gonna Good take boy. off into the studio but he could but he didn't Hi, silly. can I try to feed him once more oh, thank you so we have a lot going on at the zoo. Yes, tell um, us what's going Black on. Black Friday is a great day to come to the zoo. It's actually free. We opened it up for everybody. Stay away from the malls. Be with your family. Come idea. to the zoo. It, you know, Thanksgiving is all about you know family and whatnot. And we wanted to give everybody the opportunity to really just make memories at the zoo and uh, uh, spend the day with their family instead of just out shopping. They can wait a day. But right. uh, so come to the, the real zoo. zoo on, the exactly. Will be uh, a zoo. You know, on Black Friday, <laughs> and then um, you know our rainforest up actually opens the week after on uh, December 1st. We so, actually have uh, video of the construction that was taking place. Yeah, so we're so then. excited. Oh, just got me in the eyes. <laughs> um, but we're so excited. Now it has animals in it, all the plants are in it, and it's just come to life. So we are just thrilled to be opening that up to the public. So definitely come and check that out. It's a great opportunity to come out in the winter to warm up. You'll think you're in tropical South America. And uh, From beginning to end, Jeremy, how long did it take to put this rainforest in? It was about almost three and a half years in the making. It's really remarkable. Yeah, what really, a great feat. Really was, and, and we have Santa coming uh, yeah. um, on the uh, 23rd, 24th, and 25th to Carousel Village. So, uh, tis the season, and uh, so much going on at the zoo. So we can go, you can see the animals, and then you can actually meet Santa as well. That's awesome. So this is that. This is this Friday through Sunday. That, mm -hmm. That's right. So I uh, come to the zoo, then swing over to Carousel Village, ride the carousel, get a picture with Santa. Um, we don't take the picture, so bring your own camera, and oh, that's uh, right. that's you know, it's oh, just a, a great, affordable family fun. And Zazu will be he will mm -hmm. be be present for people to check out. He, he may make an appearance. He may make yeah. an appearance, yeah. which is but incredible. there will be ambassador animals at the uh, Santa encounter, so you'll see uh, all sorts of animals there as well. Now I know the you know the season it's getting cold and snowy, so certain animals have to be moved in or transported to other zoos. Is that no, we, uh, all of our animals stay at the zoo. They stay, year, at the zoo. they stay at the zoo year round. They have uh, large heated enclosures, more of our tropical animals like our giraffes and uh, and elephants and whatnot. But a lot of our animals love the winter. Our snow leopards are more yeah. active. Yeah. Our red pandas more active, so uh, a lot of the animals that kind of uh, sleep a lot in the heat of the summer. Um, this is the time to see them. So it's a good time to go because you do. It's always a good you time know, to come to the zoo. Kids are at school, and it's like sometimes you go and and you're right. A lot of the bigger animals you can't really see them. They're tired. Right. They're hiding. Yeah, you know, the nice less time. crowds. It's a it's a great time. You get a lot of personal attention. And, um, you know, just the animals actually really enjoy seeing the people this time of year. And Zazu is how old, Jen? Six. Six and Six life expectancy yeah. about 15, yeah. 15, yeah. 15, 15 years old. Yeah. So he's fairly, uh, is, uh, pardon me, is it a, it's a he? He, yeah. He. yeah. He's fairly Hello. young in his yeah. uh, in his life expectancy. He is. Yeah. Hello, he's such Zazu. a beautiful bird. He is. Yeah. I, love We're happy Zazu. Zazu. I love how he tries to feed you. He was really <laughs> upset that you didn't want to eat his grape. He's like, I want to give you a grape. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you guys so much for coming in. We appreciate it. <laughs>
there he wants his close-up right yeah. now. Zazu's like, I want to get a close-up. For a list of events and to learn more about the zoo, visit rwpzoo.org. It's located just over the border in Providence, Rhode Island. Thank, Thank you, Zazu. Very nice Thank job. You.